In this video, we take a look at the Light Mixer Imager. Using Light Mixer, you can essentially relight your scene during or after the render without the need to re-render. So you can adjust the color and intensity of your lights in a real-time fashion and see the results immediately. It's a very cool and useful feature, so let's see how to set it up. Hey folks, welcome to Mograph Plus. This video is a free sample from our course, The Ultimate Introduction to Arnold 6 for Cinema 4D. It's a massive 12 hours course in which we explore all the aspects of Arnold for Cinema 4D thoroughly. Make sure to check it out. The link is in the description. Also, be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. It's similar to the light manager. The difference being light mixer is more interactive. And unlike the light manager, the IPR won't reinitialize each time you change a light properties in the light mixer. To add a light mixer imager, you can go to the render settings and from the effects menu, add an Arnold imager and change the imager type to light mixer. Imagers are post-processing effects such as color correction, vignetting, light mixer, denoising, lens effects, and so on that will be applied to your rendered image. Or I can delete it here and add it from the IPR window. Just open up the post tab and add a light mixer imager. Light mixer adjusts the contribution of certain light groups to the beauty AOV. At the time being, I think it only works with the beauty AOV and does not affect other AOVs. That might change in the future. The first thing to remember is that if you have other imagers like color correct, exposure, and so on, light mixer imager should always be on top of everything, except for the noiser imagers. If I open up the light manager from the Arnold menu, you notice I already have a few light groups defined here. You can check the light manager lesson in the course if you don't know how to do that. The light mixer operates on light groups, not individual lights. So first you need to create groups in the light manager like we have done it here. And that's why we get all of these light groups in the light mixer. I'm gonna press control tab to maximize the IPR window and run the IPR. And now we can adjust the intensity, exposure, and color of each individual light group. For example, let's take the key light and work on its intensity and exposure. Or change its color. Let's mute the key light and solo all the fill lights. Maybe I can take the fill right light and increase its intensity and exposure a bit. If I control click on the solo button for the floor lamp, for example, only that individual light will be in the solo mode. And if I control click on the mute button for the same light, it will only mute this light and enables the solo mode for all the other lights. This default light group, which if soloed, you notice it's empty, contains light contributions that are not assigned to any light groups. Because we have assigned all of our lights to different light groups, there is no information in this default layer. You can also open up the light manager directly from here, or you can use this add layers button to add an existing light group manually as a layer in the light mixer. For now, let's turn off the floor lamp by setting its intensity and exposure to zero. Now, if we want to save the result of the light mixer into a separate AOV instead of the beauty AOV, we can enable this output to separate AOV checkbox, which creates a new additional AOV named beauty underscore mixed. You can rename the AOV to whatever you want, in which the mixed result will be written into instead of overwriting the beauty AOV. So now the beauty AOV is unchanged and we get this beauty underscore mixed, which has the result of the light mixer. Now this output to separate AOV feature only works in multi-layer Arnold drivers like EXR and when rendering to IPR or picture viewer, but it won't be saved in single layer Arnold drivers like JPEG or PNG. Meaning when you go for the final render, this separate AOV will be saved out only if you are using a multi-layer Arnold driver for the export 
if you are using something like PNG, the separate AOV won't be saved out. So that's about Light Mixer. See you in the next one. Make sure to visit our website mographplus.com or our Gumroad page at gumroad.com slash mographplus and check out our premium CGI and rendering courses for Cinema 4D, 3ds Max, Maya, Arnold, Corona, V-Ray, Redshift, Octane and so on. See you in the next video.